Hey, 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 it's B-Rad Celebrity Hairstylist here, the host of the Hairstylist Empowerment Podcast. Today, we have an exciting guest for you. Her name is Tracy Napotnik from Salontraining.com. So if you haven't heard of Salontraining.com, we're going to go in-depth today, find all about it. Um, This is actually an exciting um, platform that now is launching 2.0. So I want to welcome Tracy. We'll just add you to the stream here. Hello. Hey, <laughs> so good to good to see you. So with salontraining.com, when did it kind of first evolve? So 1.0, when did it kind of start? How did it start? Because I know now you're like 110% invested in, in 2.0. So kind of what was that heart, you know, connection for you that said this platform needs to happen? So it happened during the pandemic. And I know you were part of it. Quite a few other trainers were part of it. So when we were closed down and we couldn't open up our salons and I couldn't get in to help trainers or or, I'm sorry, stylists, or I couldn't get educators into my salon, which I did all the time for my team. I was I was feeling lost, like I'm sure most people were whenever we weren't allowed to be around anybody. So I said, I'm seeing some of the trainers and educators posting live videos and doing different things on, you know, just our Facebook. And I said, wouldn't it be cool if we all just had a platform that we could do this together so that, you know, salons can reach out and say, you know what, I want to take this class or this class or this class. And it was all live. And we had that open for about seven months. But when we launched was when everybody was getting back into their salons because it took us so long to build it. So we took a step back and we said, you know what, why don't we redo this whole whole site completely a lot better for everybody in the beauty industry. And that's what we did. We took a break. We asked everybody not to post any classes and let us reformat everything. And I'm so glad we did. And it is 2.0. And you're exactly right. I'm 110% involved in this one because I feel this this particular format is so much better. So trainers, or I'm sorry, I keep saying trainers because I'm always talking to trainers right now. But stylists, beauty professionals, salon owners, managers, anybody in the beauty industry could come on to salontraining.com and see different trainers that are on there, classes that are virtual, in person, or soon to be a video library. So we're really excited about it. And there's tons of other stuff like jobs. I know you talked about it. I talked about it. That's the number one thing that salon owners are saying that they need help with is is recruitment and hiring right now. So we have job listings on there. And for our first two months, we are going to have free listings for any anybody that's hiring in the beauty industry, which we're pretty excited about. And there's also other kind of stuff, which we'll talk about here in a moment. So, yeah, <laughs> but, but like you said, like there uh, something happened, I guess, like the, the, there was and same where I am here in Canada. It was like the great resignation. And all of a sudden people said, hey, I'm not going to go back to work. You know what I mean? So all these owners now are saying, where can I find high quality people? Where can I go to have a resource? And with your resource, I remember you put out. um a thing on on Facebook that said, what does the word hub mean to you, right? Mm -hmm. So with hub, you know, it means different things for different people. But as I say, like we see on the banner below, you call it the beauty Mm -hmm. professionals toolbox. So why do you say it's a toolbox Mm -hmm. as opposed to just like a hairstylist page? I'm glad you brought that up too, because uh, I love Joe Santi and I know a lot of people do from, he's, He's the perm king, as we call him. He's on the beauty industry cruise too, correct? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, He's really cool. So I messaged and talked to so many different people in the industry. And I and I know you and I talked and I said, it's kind of like a hub. And I kept going back to that word. And I really liked it, but I it just it just wasn't it just yet. And uh I give kudos to uh Joe because he said, you know, we always talk about a toolbox and I don't know. And we just kind of started talking and I put that down. I'm like, yeah, I like the toolbox because we do have so many different things in the beauty industry and in our toolbox. We have our tools, mm-hmm. of course. We have our education, our knowledge. There's so much more than just a physical tool that we need in this industry. So, yep, it's called the Beauty Professionals Toolbox. Yeah, and it's one thing I always, even with my staff, I said, you're not being a true professional if you're not giving your client everything that you have in your 
toolbox. So that means to say recommending proper products, keeping your skills up, going to classes, going to shows, you know, doing things like that. So with your site, which we'll bring up in a moment too, like for me as a trainer, I just went on there. I was one of the, I guess, first people to, to put my stuff on there, but I went back after we actually had, um, the soft launch yesterday and kind of tweaked a few things, but I found as a trainer, how easy it was. It was so easy to update. I'm like, I'm already done. <laughs> it was so simple. It, like compared to 1.0, this has, it, it's like night and day. Like when you said, I'm going to upgrade, I didn't really think it was going to be like a whole new vision, so to speak, because with, with the new one, because with, um, going through the, the different things, you have stuff for um, the trainers, the classes, the jobs, the shows, the products, the contests and give back, which I think is something really special. And on the thing yesterday, I was getting like a little choked up emotionally when I heard what you were doing, which we'll again share um, on this program as well. So if you kind of want to go through, Tracy, what these kind of categories are on the, the new website. Great. Okay. So like you said, we tried to make it as extremely pos easy as possible for people to go and list. So we'll start with there, people that are listing. If you're an educator, trainer, or coach that teaches something valuable to beauty industry professionals or spa professionals, you can go in and create a listing. We have extremely affordable prices. Do you not agree on the prices? Like they're just, they're so low. They're so low. <laughs> you know, you know and we all we so went, low. I can't limbo any lower. <laughs> I know. And, you know, I thought, you know, sometimes if you go too low, people don't think that there's value in it. And mm -hmm. like, oh, I don't know if we should put them this low, but I really wanted to, because we want to create volume for the users. We want them to be able to see multiple, multiple trainers out there, whether they're independent or whether they work for a product company. So all you have to do is create an account super easy to create an account and then you go in and there's a thing that says add listing you drop down you see add a trainer at a job at a marketplace at a product it's super simple mm -hmm. you go in and then you just fill in your in your little spots it is still technology so if you get tripped mm -hmm. up on something or something doesn't work 100 percent that particular second just don't freak out we have things on there it says contact us i'm a live person mm -hmm. that will always get back to you um uh, if I don't message me, text me is the best way to communicate with me and we will help you and myself or my team members, we can go in and help. Um, the only thing that people, and I'm going to say this, if you get stuck on something, it's usually a picture because maybe the way that it was saved on your end, like it was just saved really large. Okay. And I had someone getting real, really worked up. I thought it was easy. And then they sent it to us and we got it on. It's not a big deal, but it's 99% super easy. You might trip off on one, on one, some small thing. The other things are classes. So if you are a trainer and you have live classes, which are virtual or live in person and soon to be the paid ones, you can go in and just list those as well. Jobs. Again, we're saying that there's free job listings for anybody that is hiring in the beauty industry. You go in and make a listing. It will have your your Facebook links. It will have your social media links. It will have your phone number. You can do a video to, to talk to your potential new employees and say, Hi, you know, I'm so-and-so from so-and-so salon, and we look forward to, you can have an outgoing message to them as well. And then products. So there's so many amazing product companies out there that we don't always see because maybe they're not in our particular network at that particular time. I, I remember talking about this yesterday. You know, I remember going to the New York hair show, and there were so many products from all over the world that I never got to see from my, you know, distributor because they weren't carried at that particular place. So if you're a product company, you can go in and list all that. Marketplace. Marketplace is a free listing for anybody in the beauty industry that if you have an old pair of shears that you no longer use because you upgraded, someone else may love to get those if they're good quality and still in working condition. Same with if you redo your salon and you're upgrading all of your equipment, you can go in and post some chairs, you know, or trolleys or something like that. Someone else may really love to have that. Um, and then contests, like you mentioned, mm -hmm. 2.0 is going to be a lot different for sure, yeah. because, you know, the one was only just live classes. You have to join at that particular time. Mm -hmm. We need this and want this to be way more community driven because we want to see your work. We love looking. I'm a hairdresser. I love seeing when people post a picture of their hair color or a haircut or an updo. And so that's what our first contest will be is your color work. So before and after. 
and we have it for students and professionals so they're not competing against each other and we'll have all kinds of different contests like updos and nails and, and stuff like that and i'm super excited that you had said about the give back program because mm -hmm. that is something i think that we need to talk more about is we are a community we're in a profession that we are very giving and loving i think most of us in the beauty mm -hmm. industry and so who not better to help than someone in our own category that's suffering or going through something mm -hmm. and I'm, I'm the same with a lot of people you know sometimes there's way too many gofundmes for just lack of a better word dumb stuff <laughs> like hey, you know, exactly <laughs> my cat needs a, a haircut or something i don't know yeah but for real stuff that people are going through and i'm not saying that's not real to them but you get what i mean i know mm -hmm. but if someone has a you know salon fire that can be devastating to their home income that could be devastating whether they rebuild the salon so sometimes they just need a little help or cancer mm -hmm. cancer is huge i mean we all know that and coming up soon is breast cancer awareness month and you know there's all different types of cancer what if there was a salon owner that had to shut down her salon but now you have employees that are out of work or booth renters that are out of work you know there's all kinds of different things that can happen because of a medical condition mm -hmm. so you know we, we talked about donna hogg we love donna <laughs> she yeah, is amazing yeah yes. she's such a such an inspiration and and donna if you're watching <laughs> we're giving a shout out to you just just her as a person and i think she's so humble she's mm -hmm. so love like we actually yeah. just chatted last night myself and donna so <laughs> but 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 that's a nice thing because people don't think like in a community like you put your your phone number out there I'm not that, <laughs> but you know what I mean? They say, hey, I'm a real person. I'm available. If you'd like to talk to me, I'm here for you. Because most people like to be on high on a pedestal. I'm way up here, you know, that sort of thing. But to to get just, as I say, and this is one thing I want to put on to the, the podcast is actually if I can get the MP3 from you of yesterday's show. Oh, sure. Because I'd love people to hear from the trainers that are on there that, how amazing, but you can hear the emotion in people's voices and how, and that's the main thing too, how passionate you are about this project and how passionate the educators are about this project and how much they believe in it and how much we connect. Like you said about sharing someone's post or doing stuff like that. It's so simple and it takes literally less than two seconds to support someone. And I know even with my own, um, Facebook page. I put a lot of quotes and stuff. Then it's like, like, like 152 likes. And then here's something about my, uh, you know, work, nothing, crickets, <laughs> you know, sort of thing. So, but even if you can support people in what they're doing, it doesn't say you have to buy my product or do, but just support the, the person as well. So with that, um, so in the job category, so something that we had talked about is what if somebody is looking or needing a volunteer? Okay, so I'm glad you said that too. The volunteer was, I'm definitely giving you a shout out for this because this is what this, this project is. It's a community project. And, and I will say this over and over again, this is not a Tracy Napotnik project. This is hey, I have this idea, wouldn't it be cool if we all kind of joined together and did something amazing like this that we can all kind of share our information. And one of your suggestions during that time was, hey, what if we what if we put a, like a volunteer section on there? I was like, oh my gosh, that would be great. Because so many people at hair shows are looking for volunteers for backstage. And if you've never worked at backstage, you really should work at it sometime because <laughs> it is eye opening. Yes. Uh, if you don't mind, I'm going to give a little thing about one of the first times I worked yeah. backstage. It was at Seven Springs Air Show, which we are actually going to be doing, if you don't mind me plugging that real quick. Oh, in, of course. Yep. <laughs> plug, plug, plug. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so if it's, if it's in Western Pennsylvania. We are looking for the last date, the last Monday and Tuesday in April, and we will confirm that here. My contract will actually be here tomorrow, so we'll be confirming that here pretty soon. But anyway, that was my first hair show that I worked at when I was about 15 years old, I guess, or 16 years old whenever I was oh, in wow. high school. And it was with um, the Paul Mitchell team. So there was people there that was, I, I worked with Robert Cromies and Takashi and stuff like, I didn't know who they were. I was just mm -hmm. like, oh no, like, I remember seeing them, I don't know. And they had me go in and say, um, can you go and wash, wash these people's heads in a sink and at that time it was a sink with one faucet and in the men's bathroom i had to try to fit their yeah. head in there with cold water because there was no hot water i don't know why 
And I didn't yeah. know. I was washing and washing and washing, and the blue wouldn't go away. I wasn't really supposed to shampoo it. I was supposed to shampoo it. And so just rinse it. I, I, yeah. kept, I got their person there much later than what they needed. So oh, no. going back to volunteers, you yeah. learn a lot when you are working behind a show, and you can you can meet incredible people and get a lot of knowledge. And so also on the volunteer, if your salon is looking for if your salon's looking for help or job shattering that you offer, you'll be able to put that listing on here too. Cutathons, anything that you want to volunteer. So I think mm -hmm. that was a great, great thing to add to the yeah. program too. Yeah, because there's lots of people that say like doing shows, like with hair shows, um, you know, that need models, that need, you know, assistance, that need, as I say, to work backstage or that need. Um, I thought I just had on the volunteer side, what if somebody wants to be a volunteer? Can they put their thing and say, hey, I'm a new student. I would like to volunteer Saturdays at a salon. Can they do that or that's not available? That's not available yet, but yeah. I'm going to write that in my notes. <laughs> yeah, because somebody yeah. say, hey, I'm this yeah. or hey, I'm a model. Hey, I'm looking to do this. Then there's like a, a subcategory, um, you know, just and then the, you're not the matchmaker, but it's there and it's up the, to the people to, you know, work it out on their own. One one other thing that you have that's kind of not up and running yet is a library resource as well. So can you chat, uh, talk a little bit more about that? Yes, that will be coming very soon. We just got hosting for that particular part of it. And so what it is, is if you have any videos that you sell, just, you know, say you sell, you know, four libraries for, for four uh, recordings for hundred bucks or something, or one for $49 or whatever your, it might be on haircutting or accounting or business or whatever your thing is going to be, then they will be able to go, the audience will be able to go in and, and type like, Hey, I want to watch a video on accounting or take a class on that or, you know, haircutting or coloring or whatever. And then those particular ones, you can read through them and say, okay, I'm going to do this one. And they'll be right at the checkout. For the trainers that are going to be posting those or educators that are going to be posting them, um, the money just goes right to you. We don't take mm -hmm. any of those fees. All we take is a listing fee. So basically, we're a directory for the beauty industry so that people can find more resources. So even like hair shows, not to get off topic on that, mm -hmm. but I love the fact that hair shows are going to start to be on there. Now, granted, when you go there, if you're if you're hearing this early on, this is, you know, September 2022. If you hear this podcast at a later time, this will be a lot, there'll be a lot more on there. But right now, we're just going to keep building up and building up. So that was our soft opening is to actually open it so people can see how to list. So you will be able to find pre-recorded videos on there coming soon and shows and events so that you don't have to hear about a hair show two weeks before it opens. You can hear about it a month or, you know, or a year. I'm sorry, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> to, because I have my event that's on there and it's in May of 2023, but we'll just jump to it. So if you're on Spotify or you're on YouTube, you can actually see the video version of this. If you're just listening, then you can kind of imagine. <laughs> so, so here we are on the, um, the salon training.com site. So here is my event here, beauty uh, industry cruises.com where you can kind of look through, you can see what's, what's available. Um, you can, let's see if we can get it up a little bit larger there. So, okay. So maybe it won't scroll here, but you can basically see, but it shows you kind of everything that's available. So if you want to have your link there, if you want to have a description there, if you want to put your social media links there, if you want to put your contact on there, um, everything is sort of right there, as I say, because, um, and I updated this very easily. I just did it yesterday and literally, I don't know, less than a minute, it was done. So I just did it. It's approved and it was up. It was ready, ready to go. But it's amazing how simple it is for the trainers and for actually probably user friendly as well to find all the categories, how easy it is, very easy to sign up. So one thing I'll probably do and talk to you about as well. So with your contest, so what if somebody wanted to donate a prize to your contest? That would be fabulous. And we would definitely give you some shout outs for doing so. So thank you. If you do, just uh, you can go to the website and see my cell phone number in the contact me. It is 814-248-8928. You can text me at any time. Yes, there's email, but I have to admit, I hate email. We get <laughs> lost in email land. I do not like email, and I'm sorry. I need yeah. to jump on board with that. But uh, texting is the best for me because I'm always having my phone, and then I can reply back. It's very hard when people call. Just put that out there. Please don't call me 
because I'm usually on a podcast. I'm usually, on, you know, mm-hmm. talking to someone and then the phone just keeps ringing and ringing, ringing through. And then by the time I remember to, to find out who it was, it's too late. Text me. I can read it and I can call you back. <laughs> yeah. And that makes it the easiest to say I'm not a big phone person myself. Same like you busy all the time, but I prefer like Facebook Messenger or yeah. just a text. And then it's written and it's much easier because a lot of times people will call and they'll leave a message, but it's so quick. You either can't understand their name or, hey, Tracy, I'm at 5798. And it's like, what? And you've yeah. got to listen to it 10 times to f- figure out who's who's calling you sort of thing. But there's something that's coming up that you're doing. So you can tell me about some of the hair or at least one of the hair shows that are coming up that you're involved in. Yes. So Premier Ohio, that's in Columbus, Ohio, that is coming up the first uh, Sunday and Monday in October, which is a few weeks from now. We will have a booth downstairs. Just come over and check it out because we'll have prizes on our table too that we're going to give away at the end of the show. All you have to do is submit your information. And we're not going to harass you and send you 20 emails a day, blah, 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 blah. We will get your email and we will contact you about upcoming shows, events, you know, different things like that you'd be interested in. And anytime that you don't want to, we'll take you off, I promise. Um, And then we'll invite you to the Facebook group. So when you're there, if you see this, you know, at our stand, you can do that. And then also we do have some trainers that are going to be visiting our table every so often that are going to be doing some live different things like there. Or if you need help with you know, hey, I'm looking for this particular coach for my salon or myself, then I can say, you know what, I know this one, this one, and this one that I think would be great for you and kind of guide you in that direction too. If you are going to that and you are a product vendor, stop and visit us too because we're, we have amazing prices like we talked about at the start of this. Those prices aren't going to last forever. Those are no. till the end of October that we're going in extremely low. And again, if you're hiring, come visit our booth too, or just go onto the website and list it. But we have a lot to offer at the hair show. So that would be one. Um, We'll also be at Mentors and Masters. That is going to be in November. That is in, I think, Virginia. (laughs) Now I forget. We're in (laughs) Nixon, I'm pretty sure it's Virginia. And that is Mentors and Masters is also on our website. You can check it out. That is a great thing for anybody that is a salon owner or manager or anybody that is in the leading portion of their team, if they're a trainer, coach, like said, salon owner, manager, and thing that mm-hmm. that information is amazing. And then also in April, like I said, we are going to be doing a hair show of our own with tons and tons of vendors and stage performance. And for, there'll be four hands on classes a day, one being color, one being haircut, and the other two to be to be determined. And then all the other shows, of course, that are going to be um, that you can go go in and stuff like that. It's going to be really, really, really fun. <laughs> Yeah, and there's lots of stuff going on, and especially if anybody knows Nikki or Gino, you know, they have an incredible lineup coming up. You know what I mean? It's and it's funny because I I'm almost calling this cruise the salontraining.com live because most of the trainers that we have on the cruise are actually on salontraining.com. So that's what I'm saying. So everybody can go around and say, if you want to see everybody live, it's a great way to see them live, see them in person, do that sort of thing as well. But um, as we kind of wrap up, if somebody wanted to sign up, what are, you don't have to give prices, but what are the categories they can sign up for starting from the free category to the like top category? So I'm in the top category. So we'll do a shout out for that too. Yes, <laughs> uh, right. What they get if they sign up at the yearly, the yearly rate. Okay, so we have our free listings for just, we'll just use the trainer one. Yep. Trainers have free listings. Anybody can have a free listing on there. Uh, there's no pictures or nothing with that, but at least it has your name and stuff like that on there. And then we have our claimed listing, which you get a few like tags and, and I think your email or something like that as well. And then you have your advanced listing, which gives you multiple tags, multiple class listings. It gives you a lot of bells and whistles and pictures, multiple pictures, videos, all kinds of things. And then our spotlight listing, which they get an interview on your show and they, yeah. um, they, they can talk to Brad. And then what we'll do is we'll also have an editor that's going to subscribe. Um, sub- I can't say it. They're going to uh, transcribe. Yeah. transcribe it to yeah. into. So you will have written form that you can use for for later, too. And that price is incredible because you, you get all of those things that you can use. And those that's for a year. You get to be mm-hmm. on the site for an entire year at the, at the prices that we have on there. Then exactly. That, you know, I'm sure the prices will go up at some point. We're still we're still not here to gouge people. Uh, you know, I like making money, too. And I've been a business owner for 20 years. But I also 
believe in this project so much. I quit mm -hmm. my salon. I closed my salon. Yes. That's what I said. A hundred, a hundred and ten percent. Like right. literally, Tracy is all is all in. Because I remember when you told me, "I've given up my salon. I'm all in." Like you know what I mean. So this is someone who's very passionate. But anybody listening, this is your time to get in now on 2.0. This is your time really to get in to 2.0 because I think the investment, the the value that you receive far outweighs the investment that you put in. So to me, it's like a no brainer because even to have like a, a podcast done with myself or Tracy's been doing some amazing ones. So if you go on uh, her Facebook uh, group and things like that, if you watch, she has Iva coming up. She has some great uh, trainers that have already been, been on, which is so wonderful to actually see. So it's not like you're going on a site here, paying me the money, get it's like a transactional. This is not transactional. It's actually, you know, conversational, inspirational. You know, it, it, it's, it's, um, you can tell when I talk faster, I get excited and passionate about stuff. <laughs> so this is something, thing. this is something I'm really passionate about. And say, when somebody reaches out to you and says, Hey, I think you would be great for this, you know what I mean? That in itself is a blessing. That in itself is, you know, as I say, like you get taken back and say, Oh, they're looking at me. You know, because we all think we don't have enough value, but I think we all have a story. We all have something to share. I think we all have now, Tracy, like the platform, salontraining.com, where you can sh share your knowledge, share your skills, increase your income, share a free class if you want. You know, you can have all that, put it in the video library, um, donate prizes. Uh, there's so much now that you can do on 2.0 that before it was only just a live class virtually. And that's, you know, now it's expanded leaps and bounds. It's just kind of gone. I, I don't know. I, it's, I don't even have any more words, Tracy. I don't, if, if you <laughs> like think how, about, how incredible it is. Well, yeah. Thank you. If you think about, uh, like you said, being different places, you should be different places. So I, I'm excited that what you're saying. So I appreciate that very much because it is a community. And you should be on ours at this going in price for sure. And then, you know, talk to Brad, talk to Oprah interviews thousands of people, right? Mm -hmm. Because they are not only talking to her, they're on different places. Tony Robbins, you always hear me talk about Tony Robbins. I love that. Yeah, and I love Tony <laughs> Robbins. I met him live. I met oh, him live. Yep. Yeah, He's so. <laughs> so incredible what he talks about. And they, and his team always says, be on everybody else's stages, be on everybody's platform, yes. ask for the interview. We'll do an interview with you. If you're a trainer and you're part of our team, we also have a private group just for our trainers so that we can communicate back and forth there that we're going to be doing a lot more here coming up on that. So you're never going to be alone. I don't think, even though you may be. You may be independent, but yeah. you're never going to be alone whenever you're with us. No, the community is definitely there. The community is definitely supportive. As I say, whenever you do a video or like this one, this now has a shelf life of forever. Mm -hmm. So it, it'll go on and people can watch over and over and over. And the funny thing is, because my trainer is actually Tony Robbins trainer. Nice. So what he yeah. said was the same sort of thing. Get yourself on a get yourself on a show as a guest. Well, I went that one step up. And became a show, a television show host. And my show ran for three years. So it depends on how you kind of, you know, put yourself out there. But this is a great resource if you're a new trainer, if you're a seasoned trainer, to definitely get on salontraining.com. Tracy is always there. Her team is always there to help you to connect or say, hey, what are my next steps? How do I sign up? I'm having trouble with you know, putting in my, my address, whatever it might be, uh, Tracy is there for you. So as we wrap up, Tracy, I always ask our guests, if they can give one nugget of gold, what would you like to share with our audience? Never stop learning ever. Amazing. Amazing. So thank you so much. Um, and if you would like to, uh, be, uh, if you would like to be featured on the show, you can email me at hairstylist empowerment podcast at Outlook. And also, too, with Tracy, once you get that spotlight package, like she said, that you actually get um, 
a com I'd rather say a conversation than an interview uh, with me that you can use for promotion, that you can put on all your social media, that you can, I thought, you know, it's a wonderful, wonderful idea. Um, and today's episode was sponsored by the Beauty Industry Cruises, Professional Edge, uh, ah, I can't even talk now, Professional Vacations and Education to the Best Place Around the World. So they have one coming up May 7th to 12th, uh, Mayan Soul on Virgin Voyages. So make sure to check it out at www.virginvoyages.com and make sure to go to right now, right now, turn this video off and go right now to salontraining.com, sign up uh, as a trainer or as a student, even go through the sites, check out, see what's there, go on to their uh, Facebook and yeah, check, check them out. I definitely recommend it. And if I don't stop now, I'll probably talk for the can next I hour. Ask, can I just mention one small thing? You small sure thing? can. So whenever you go in and log on as a um, a user, make sure that you hit the join the community and register. You don't you don't have to see it to do the site. But if you join the community, we invite you to different things that may not be posted or shared. So you want to do that. Plus, we're going to be getting ready to do a lot of different prizes for people that are in that community. So amazing well we talked so much already it's it's uh, i went like twice as long as i thought it was going to because we have so much <laughs> so much to chat about so i'll say thank you to everybody see you on the flip side